How's my hair? It's good? It's Look good? Fabulous. All right, right on. What's up, LC? I just want to take a few minutes to talk to you guys about some things uh, because I respect you guys and I love you guys and I want you guys to hear from me because I know there's some rumors that are going on uh, around the building, around the corporation. Um, but I have thought about this a lot um, for months, weeks, and um, it's not an easy thing to say um, because I do care very, very much about all of you. Um, but I did make the decision recently to retire from the police department, uh, from the Dyer Police Department, uh, as well as the Lake Central School Corporation and the Northwest Regional SWAT Team. Um, it is kind of fast uh, moving at this point. My last day at Lake Central will be December 23rd, um, yes, of this year. And my last day in the Northwest Regional SWAT Team is also going to be that exact same day on December 23rd. My last day as a police officer in the town of Dyer is going to be January 20th. This has been my life for the past 20 years. It's been my life here in the schools for the past 14 years. Um, and I've made some absolutely amazing memories and uh, a lot of great, great people and friends and families and uh, some awesome experiences um, that I know that's going to help me in my next career path. I want you guys to be happy for me uh, because I'm happy for all of you guys uh, all the time. So um, I love you guys very, very much, more than you will ever, ever know. I wanna be positive about all this. This is not a sad time by any means. This is a reward. This is a great thing for me because um, I have an absolutely amazing um, an opportunity ahead of me. I get to now, hopefully uh, um, in the, this next position, I'll be able to train police officers, train security officers on how to work inside of schools and work with kids uh, every day. and. Uh, School safety is really something that has, is near and dear to my heart now. Um, and now I can help mold people to, you know, do the right things when they're inside the schools to help, you know, you guys out. What am I gonna miss the most? Honestly, it's, it's gonna be kids in every, you know, every shape, form, whatever. I mean, it's, I mean, it's definitely gonna be missing the kids. Some of the other things I'm going to miss are obviously the officers that I've worked with, uh, um, over the years in Dyer, but you know, also the surrounding communities. You know, I've, we've got an absolutely amazing, I can't say they're mine, um, but they're all of ours, uh, SRO team. Um, you know, yeah, Mike Moffat is here every single day. Um, and we've got Nick Stamey over in St. John, Steve Burton in Cherville, and Brian Kissinger in Dyer. Um, we've made a pretty awesome team over the years. First off, I'd like to thank the school board and Dr. Baracco and Mr. Al Gandolfi, who is retired at this moment too, um, for the opportunity um, back in 2014 to uh, take a chance on me and bringing me into the school resource officer program. I also would like to thank the teachers, the custodians, the kitchen staff, um, our paras, the bus drivers, um, uh, all of our secretaries. It's been pretty awesome to go to 10 different buildings 11, you know, different, 12 different sites and uh, and get to meet so many wonderful people. Not only am I here most of the time at Lake Central High School, uh, but I, uh, I also just wanted to sh give a little shout out and some love to Kaler Middle School, uh, Bibich Elementary, Prosman Elementary, my dire, my dire roots. I also have to get a shout out to like, you know, Grimmer Middle School, Holman Elementary, um, Pfeiffer Elementary, Watson Elementary, Clark Middle School and Colling Elementary School. I have to especially thank um, all my kids because you guys are all my LC kids. <laughs> just feel like uh, everyone I just named has been a very big part of my life. You know, you never really know the true impact that you have on those around you. You never know how much someone needed the smile that you gave them. You never know how much your kindness turned someone's entire life around. You never know how much someone needed a long hug or a deep talk. So don't wait to be kind. Don't wait for someone else to be kind first. Don't wait for better circumstances or for someone to change. Just be kind because you never know how much someone else needs it. You know, I hope that I was able to be um, a positive part of all of your lives because you guys have been that for me too. And thank you guys all for always being respectful to me and letting me be that guy for you. Please do me a favor, if you would, come down and see me either in my office 
you know, during lunch times or whenever it is that you see me. And um, yeah, I love to shake some hands, give some hugs, and you know, say some goodbyes. So uh, thank you, Elsie. I love you guys, and I'll always have your guys' back.